Okay, then look at the page 61. So we want to cover a few more uh, examples, but this time no more uh, radical expression. We will do the rational exp exponent expression. So look at um, B please. If you look at the B, then you will get 64 to the one third power. So this means in order to simplify this expression, then you need to factorize, uh, prime factorizing this number first. So, 64 means what times what? Yeah, 8 times 8. And then this becomes 4 times 2 and 2 times 2. So, 4 times 2 and 2 times 2. So, you can rewrite this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, 64 means 2 to the 6th power and that to the 1 third power. Now, you know that the property a to the m times n and to the n equal to a to the m n. Therefore, this becomes 2 to the 6 times 1 third. So, it, going, it, it is going to be 2 to the 6 over 3, which means 2 to the square power. So answer become 4. Okay, another example, maybe h. h is 125 over 64 to the 1 third power. Even though this is a fraction form, we do exactly the same thing. And then we also want to apply the property a to the a over b to the r equal to a to the r over b to the r. So you distribute first then become 125 to the 1 third power over 64 to the 1 third power. Next step, prime factorization of each number. So 125 means 5 times 25, 25 means 5 times 5, and 64, 8 times 8, 2 times 4, and 2 times 2, 2 times 4, and 2 times 2, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So you can rewrite this 5 cubed to the 1 third over 2 sixth to the 1 third. And then you apply this property one more time. Then this is going to be 5 to the 3 times 1 third over 2 to the 6 times 1 third. So 5 to the 3 over 3 over 2 to the 6 over 3. So it is 5 to the 1 power over 2 to the square power. So answer become 5 over 4. So look at the page 62. Then you see the question is a little bit harder. So let's look at C first. Then 16 to the 3 over 4th power. Even so, you are doing exactly the same step what I shown before. So step 1 prime factorizing this number okay so 16 means 4 times 4 2 times 2 and 2 times 2 so this is going to be 2 to the fourth power to the 3 over fourth power so 2 to the 4 times 3 over fourth power so which is 2 to the cube power because they cancelled out so it becomes 8 that should be the answer. What about um somehow we have this kind of expression like um j twenty five to the one over two power plus twenty seven to the two over third power. Still same, but we are doing each one different step here. So finding those those two numbers prime factorization so 25 means 5 times 5 
27 means 9 times 3 and 3 times 3 here. So this is going to be 5 squared to the 1 over 2 power plus 3 cubed to the 2 third power. Therefore this become 5 plus 3 squared which is 5 plus 9 equal to 14. Okay?